In the UK, we have pioneered an ambitious approach to tackling climate change, backed by strong legislation. It's 10 years since that legislation, the Climate Change Act, became law, supported by a huge majority in Parliament. The Act places a legal requirement on the government to dramatically reduce the UK's greenhouse gas emissions by 2050. It must also prepare the UK for the effects of climate change, like worsening heat waves, drought and flooding. To help achieve these targets, the Committee on Climate Change was created, an organisation independent of government that advises and reports to Parliament each year. So far, the UK has done well, with a 43% fall in emissions since 1990. Much of this progress has come from new ways of generating electricity. Coal-fired power plants are being closed, as more electricity is produced without burning fossil fuels. Last year, for the first time, the majority of the UK's electricity came from renewable or low-carbon sources. The cost of renewable electricity, particularly offshore wind, has dropped dramatically thanks in part to the committee's call for fundamental reform of the market. To help prepare for climate change, more investment is being put into flood defences, water consumption is falling and electricity and water companies are protecting their infrastructure. But more needs to be done and challenges remain. Emissions from our transport system, our buildings and industry are not falling fast enough. We still need to reduce emissions from the way we use our land and eliminate emissions from the waste we produce. Further action is needed to protect new homes from heat and flooding and to improve the natural environment. In 2015, countries around the world agreed to try and limit global warming to well below 2 degrees C. It was a landmark moment and in early 2019, the Committee on Climate Change will advise government on how the Paris Agreement should be translated into new long-term emissions targets for the UK. Guided by the Climate Change Act, the decade to come will be critical in cementing the UK's role in the global effort to tackle climate change.